Chains, shackles, a shock collar for dogs. These are the weapons investigators say Eduardo Paso's own family used against him. The coroner observed his young body much different from this picture. Instead, bruised and skeletal. His father, Luis Poso, and stepmother, Diana Flores, now charged with neglect, battery, and confinement. Investigators say they were contract employees passing out flyers for a traveling circus coming to Bloomington. But when the Pasos and their three other children worked, detectives say they left Eduardo chained up in this motel. Flores says her husband physically abused Eduardo because he acted up more than their other kids. The 12 year old stopped breathing in that motel Friday and died within 10 minutes of arrival at Bloomington Hospital. You don't even want to let your mind go to imagine what this child's thoughts were and what his prospects for his future were. Everybody involved with this case has been very deeply affected and will be affected until the end of our career, let alone the end of our lives. I mean, there's really no words for this type of abuse. And because the family's transient and traveled all over, they could face more charges up to and including murder. Meanwhile, the couple arrested is being held in the Monroe County Jail on a half million dollars bond each, their first court hearing on Friday. Jenny Runovich, Channel 13 Eyewitness News.